Hey guys, this is Cyril Jeet and today I wanted to make a quick video showing you how advertising on Facebook can go wrong if you don't take care. So this is an ad from Fiat India. This ad has been promoted quite a lot and it just talks about uh, some EMI options, some financing options on Fiat cars which are being sold in India. And that's fine. It's got a lot of traction, 6,938 likes so far. And they're not organic. This ad is a sponsored ad. It's being promoted. It's being uh, pushed by Fiat. And that's perfectly fine. The ad itself, there's nothing wrong with it. It's not very attractive. It's not very catchy, but that is not the point. I'm going to show you how exactly the ad agency or the agency that's marketing Fiat uh, marketing this Fiat ad or, or running this Fiat ad in India is actually doing a self goal for Fiat and making the ad work against Fiat India. Now let's let's just look at the comments. Just look at the feedback. Most of the people here are criticizing Fiat for some reason. So they're talking about uh, you know the issues that they're having about the cars and that is perfectly natural. If you bought a car, you're going to talk about the issues. You know, you've got things like do not buy any Fiat car, four breakdowns in a year, then Fiat wake up, body strong but basement weak. And, uh, you know, some, some, some positive news is also there. Uh, but, you know, some people are very, very angry. And these advertise and, and, you know, these guys, the advertisers who are running this campaign, are not sanitizing the ads they're not deleting the negative feedback you got you've even got some spam over here for example this one it says uh, you can earn 15,000 or whatever um, you know money every month by joining some digital India and bullshit like that so this is something that they really should have changed you know uh, they should have made sure that they delete that they remove all the negative feedback. If you're going to promote a post, you're going to invest money in it, and you're going to show it to more people, make sure you take a look and monitor the comment section very carefully, that you remove the negative feedback by clicking on this uh, cross button over here, which will make it visible only to that person who made the comment and his friends. And if you got a very poisonous uh, you know, commentator, a very poisonous guy writing against your product, whatever you're promoting, make sure you ban him because you don't want him to come back and abuse your product again and ruin your market. Not caring enough for your comment section is going to reduce your conversions quite a bit and you're not going to be able to sell things easily. So this is one thing you need to take care of uh, when you advertise online on Facebook. Keep an eye on the comment section, on the engagement and make sure the engagement is positive and there is a positive message. Now, if you see some messages which are not totally uh, in complaint, you can resolve them by answering them or replying to them. So even if you believe that you should not delete the comments for some reason, that's fine. But make sure you address each complaint and you are specific. You show them that you care because right now nobody is monitoring this section and nobody is replying to uh, all these people from Fiat India and that is causing a major damage. I have no doubt that people who might be planning to buy a Fiat car would look at the comment section, look at all the people complaining against Fiat and, uh, uh, you know, talking about how Fiat is not addressing the customer's uh, problems, they're not going to buy a Fiat car. So this is like a self call. It's advertising against, in, you know, itself. So don't make that mistake. Make sure you take care of engagement.